All right, we're on hole number three of the second anniversary tournament in the Ricky division. Let's go to hole number three and take a look at what we're dealing with. Remind ourselves what the hole is. Okay, we're coming at this over here with a rock, a sniper, and a kingmaker. Our goal is to get up into the front here. We're using maximum left hand side spin, one back spin on our rock. And then we're going to come at it with our sniper and we're going to do a 1.1 per ring adjustment with the sniper. All right, let's go back into the game. Let's make sure we got a our rock bag. Okay, so we have a quarter back here. <coughs> 221. That will be the one. And the only reason we're it's this the the choice here is simple. Whichever one of these has the most distance, that's the one you're going to go with. So if yours are at a point where your rock has got more distance than your quarterback, you're going to use your rock. More than likely, you're going to end up using your quarterback. And with the shot, you'll have to apply just a little teeny bit of overpower or leave a little teeny bit of wind in. Okay, so we've got a uh, guardian. And we got a sniper and a rock. All right, here we go. This is all about laying yourself up and giving yourself the, the ideal second shot. And pretty much any wood you have will work on this second shot. If you've got, it's not really gonna matter whether you have higher developed or lower developed clubs. The second shot is you can use a Spin. You can see with the rock how the second bounce is over the sand. Um, with the extra, with the quarterback, it might not be. It might be right on that transition. So you'll have to either leave a little bit of that wind in, or you'll have to slightly overpower it. You can see there's like a little depression right here on the course, and that's about where we want to be, right there in that little depression. We don't need to get way up there at the top. We don't have to press the issue up there. Just a nice, easy layup shot. No overpower. No risky stuff. You'll notice that I was way off from the fringe. I left myself three rings off the fringe. It's really important when you're doing these types of shots <clears throat> that move where the first bounce, that you're trying to either move the ball to the left or the right, that you're up against that rough area that you leave yourself lots of room. I see a lot of people hit that shot or hit shots just like that. And they end up pinching right up against the cut between the rough and the fairway and then if anything happens and they hit a great shot especially if it's on that same side that bam they're in the rough and you just ruined it and we want to go right at it we're three per, we're one one per ring so there's three three so we're gonna go a little shy of three rings Oh, we hit it great to the right. Get no. <laughs> Our opponent is in trouble. It always amazes me how easy you can get into trouble on such an easy layup shot. When you're scouting out these holes, you have to ask yourself, is this one of those drives that I got to get everything on? Like, wow, if I don't get all the way up there, I'm in big, big trouble. 
Or is it like, hey, I just need to get to this spot right here so that I can set myself up for that second shot. If it's a layup shot, man, you got to really bring bring good stuff. You're just bring stuff that will ensure that you can get that layup shot done. I play a lot of one on one with a quarterback. I play a lot of one on one with just a common bag quarterback, sniper, Saturn, claw. We played the uh, Nordic Fords, all of the Nordic Ford holes here at the uh, in the Christmas tournament just a month ago. And those holes during the tournament, we used a lot of big power balls. But I've been playing those same holes with a, quarter, with a quarterback and a marlin, and I'm still getting them done. You're not as uh, you're not setting yourself up as much for the eagles and for those shots. You're having to take a little bit more difficult shot, but if you're doing layup shots like on that hole right there, bring good stuff because our opponent went from one bad spot to another bad spot to another bad spot. All right, that was hole number three of the second anniversary tournament in the rookie division. Thanks for watching.